this is the subject of the Superfund status for the whole body of water. And I had shown before the body of water as a body. We did our tour, as I say, from here up to there and back and through. And it seemed that we could, um, looking at the channel and you see in the video, uh, place uh, seaweed along the margins such that you begin to remove the contaminants in the water and even uh, when it flocculates in the water bed or the C4 bed of the creek. Plants absorb sediments. Plants absorb chemicals and so on in the water. They're, that's our business, absorbing stuff. So if you have green or brown water, it becomes less green or brown. I'm, I'm Patterson Beckwith, and um, I'm an artist and a teacher, and I'm probably one of the most active recreational paddlers on Newtown Creek. As, um, there's a lot of people kayaking in the city and some people canoeing. I really like to paddle on Newtown Creek. I work for Newtown Creek Alliance, which is a community nonprofit dedicating to restoring and revealing and revitalizing Newtown Creek. The more serious issues are that the industrial development there and the uh, sewage outfalls during the storms and so on are enough to make the river um, more of a a lot of the work we did historically was really was like advocating for the Superfund designation so it cleaned up. But also, you know, it started, you know, it's very land-based as well. 